الله من الشيطان الرجيم وأنفقوا مما رزقناكم من قبل أن يأتي أحدكم الموت فيقول رب لولا أخرتني إلى أجل قريب إلى أجل قريب فأصدق وأكم من الصالحين And give out of what we have provided you before death comes to one of you and says My Lord if you would only reprieve me for a little while, I will give you in charity. I will give in charity and become one of the righteous. Uh, brothers and sisters, one of the most inevitable things that will happen during the blessed month of Ramadan is that we will be requested to give for the sake of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and give sadaqah. Sadaqah is a well-known uh, act of obedience. But during Ramadan and sometimes when we're asked, we turn off. We perhaps don't recognize the... Incro the incredible uh, weight that is given to this incredible act of, uh, of, of ibadah But the truth is brothers and sisters Sadaqah is more than just giving charity You see when brothers and sisters request us to give sadaqah They usually bookend that request with a promise That is made by Allah and his messenger sallallahu alayhi wa sallam And that is what the true uh, calling is for But when we give sadaqah We are not being asked just to give money but we're being asked to be truthful to the promise of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Now, look at the importance of this act. Allah talks to us about the man who is now dead and his only wish is to come back to give sadaqah. He is someone who now sees the actual fruits of sadaqah. He's in the hereafter. He sees the mountains of good deeds. He sees the weight of these, this act on, its, on, on the scales. And so... We now being here on this side of the fence as opposed to having been dead like the person in this verse Have an opportunity to really enact this very incredible and noble act of worship To be truthful to the promise of Allah when he says that your wealth will never decrease in charity And that you will be with the Prophet of Allah وسلم, in heaven and very closely because of your act of charity So do not be stingy, be truthful to the promise of Allah and recognize that this is your test when you are being asked to give sadaqah, wassalamu alaikum.